Hey everybody, Anne here. It's time to get up. Come on, Judy. Time to get up, girl. Good morning, baby chickens. Oh my gosh, look at that water. And their food bowl thingy. I just took the top off last night. And they demolished everything that's inside. <laughs> This coop needs to be cleaned so bad. That little ladder thing they go up and down, that's a daily thing. They're getting so gosh darn big. Yeah, so this is what I wake up to every morning. It's a good life. I'm heading into town, and you all know how much I love heading into town. But I got a couple things waiting for me at my post office box, and I got to pick up. I'm really excited to see what they are. And then I'm going to head home, take the chickens outside, and uh, see if I can figure out some more stuff about their living area. Looky there, two more boxes. I get to go home and open these up. I'm so excited. I'm home now. The chickens are outside running around their little coop. They're so happy and Judy's running around like a crazy dog. And before I sat down here to take a little rest, I had to redo the water catchment system and I'll show you that in a little bit. But it looks like it's going to rain, so I guess I better open these pressies. Alrighty, the first one. Oh, it's heavy. Heavy. It says it's from eBay. Don't know what it is. So let's find out. This is like happy birthday to me, early birthday. It's not till the 26th actually, but I'm gonna go ahead and open these anyhow. So let's see what they are. There's one that somebody said they're sending me that I don't know if this is it. It might be, it kind of feels like it might be, but it is, if it's, it is what I think it is, it's gonna be mind freaking blowing. All right. prepare to be blown. Your, your mind's being blown. Oh my goodness. Oh my freaking Lord. Oh my Lord have mercy. I got a Berkey. I cannot believe it. These things are expensive. Oh my goodness. Okay. Alrighty. Oh my gosh. Okay. I have to open this up so I'm going to just, I, I'll be right back. I've got a Berkey. I cannot believe I have a Berkey. These things, well, let's just say I could never, ever have afforded to get one of these on my own. No way. Not with the lifestyle that I live now. You know, I, I work less and enjoy my life more. And so this is a luxury that, well, I know this sounds kind of like cliche, but it is a game changer. You know, I do have my little water filter that, well, my big water filter that I built. And I'm very proud of this, uh, very proud of that. But this filter is just Janet. It comes from Janet W. Okay, I'm just going to say Janet W. Thank you, Janet. I cannot, I cannot believe you got me a Berkey water filter. <laughs> I feel like this is a great birthday. So I'm going to put it all together and I'm going to take it inside. And this is what I'm going to use to water, uh, to filter my water with. So thank you so much, Janet. I love it. And I love you for sending it to me and thinking enough of me to, to do this. I mean, this is just, whew. you know what? And they are, I, uh, a couple months ago, I looked online. I was considering, uh, kind of maybe, maybe if I could get one and they're sold out. A lot of them are sold out and you know, you have to back order them and stuff like that, but I have a Berkey. I cannot believe it. Thank you, Janet. Thank you so much. Happy birthday to me. Okay, I've got one more. I've got one more package, and all right, I'm going to open it right now. Oops. I don't know what it is, and it cause, because it came to my post office box, so I'm going to find out right now what it is. Oh, this is so cool. All right. What did I get? What did I get? Bubble wrap. <laughs> I'm, <clears throat> I'm saving those up. 
when I get to 5,000 subscribers, I'm going to do another, another bubble wrap thing. Who knows? Maybe I'll just wrap my body in it or something and roll down a hill. All right, so what is this? What is it? I don't know what it is. I need to cut into it. Oh my gosh. This is a market basket. Look at this. You could use it for so many things, but I know exactly what I'm going to use it for. Let me take, just take this out. Well, you can use it to go shopping in. Definitely. But, see this here? This is what it is. It folds up. Here, let me show you. See? It folds up nice and tiny. And it's like this. And you know what I'm going to do with this? This is going to be my harvesting basket. I don't have a harvesting basket. Basket. Somebody had sent me little um, dog do plastic baggies, <laughs> and I use well clean ones. Clean ones. I use those to like put herbs in and stuff, uh, kind of separate them and bring them inside. I'm not going to have to do that now. I can use those for actual dog poop. <laughs> and I got a market basket. I have a harvesting basket. I mean, I could take this to the store and go shopping with it, but I'm not going to. I'm going to use it to harvest, harvest my... Is it herbs or herbs? You know what? I, I'm like torn between the two. Seriously. Um, my herbs <laughs> and my vegetables. I am going to use this to harvest those and I will be able to have it with me at all times. It's lightweight. It's not plastic, so it's not going to you know, make the stuff get gross and whatnot before you have a chance to get to it and do something. So, let's see. Is there a note? There's, is there no note? Sometimes they put them under the flap. It doesn't say who it's from. Oh, that's going to bug me. I don't have OCD or anything, but... I mean, I have to, I have to know. It doesn't say who it's from. It doesn't say who it's from. Well, I tell you what, whoever you are, this was a very, very thoughtful gift. I needed something like this so bad, and this is gonna be perfect. Oh, it's got a zipper. I can put like little scissors in it and whatnot. Thank you, whoever you are. If you want to introduce yourself or let me know who you are, please leave me a comment or shoot me an email. If you don't want everybody to know, just shoot me an email so I can just thank you personally for it. This is so cool. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, well, let me show you a few things around my tiny fledgling homestead and hopefully it won't start raining before I finish this video. I had to replace the tarp on this because the other one had been beat up by the wind so much uh, it had holes in it so yep I've gone back to the old one it's kind of clean but you know what it doesn't matter now because I have a Berkey water filter and I don't have to worry about nothing so um, I just put this one up it's a little bit thicker um, and just set it up just like it was before it was super hot out here when I did it but it's nice and cool now breeze has come up so, yeah, there's just sticks. A subscriber had suggested that I put sticks in the side and just roll them together and secure them and bring them in like that. So, it has been working really well. So, hopefully it'll work with this tarp too. And there was a time, oh, it was about three or four days ago, where all three of these barrels were filled up. So, hopefully over the next week we're supposed to get some rain. Hopefully I will get some more water. It was super sunny and hot earlier, but I still wanted the chickens to be able to come out and play around and whatnot, so I just added the uh, tarp that was in the water catchment system over the top of this. I know it looks janky right now, but it's not permanent. And they are growing so big. Would you just look? Would you look at these chickens? They've got their little tail feathers. Can you see? They've got their cute little tail feathers. Even Patsy. Uh, which one is Patsy? Patsy is off over there. She's right there. Even her tail feathers are coming in now. And look, they're just getting so big and they just look so beautiful. They're eating, they're pooping, they're drinking. Sunshine is right there. 
sunshine's right there. Now, they have this little routine, and I'll see if I can capture it on film tonight. But one of them, I'm not sure if it's sunshine, because it's dark when this happens. Sunshine are the second biggest one. One of them will start chirping really super loud when it's time to go night-night. And then they all kind of go up the little ramp and into that little house in the brooder thing that I've got inside. And then they all just go lay down and fall asleep. Just look at them. They're getting so big. Oh my goodness. I just love having chickens. Alrighty. So I think it's going to rain. Yep, I feel it raining. Let's go down to the street and take a look at a couple things. I came out to water things. And I think you guys have seen that one before. But check this one out. Would you look at that? Look how big it is. I didn't even see that. Oh my gosh. I'm going to get at least one watermelon. Man, I tell you what, it is growing and growing. I'm going to get a watermelon, guys. Look at it. I don't want to even want to mess with it. I don't want to jinx it. And then I got that other nice one over there. And my spaghetti squash is getting bigger and bigger. Check out these stupid cucumbers. Can you see that? There's a ton of cucumbers on this. Look at, there's one over there. I'm not going to go through the whole thing. This is just so crazy because, remember, I, these are transplants. And I figured I'm just going to leave them. If they grow, they grow. And guess what? They're growing. <laughs> and now for some chicken cam. That's all I got for you today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.